Do you know what these crayons mean? What do they mean to you? Do you know what they mean? I have no idea. We're going to tell you in a little bit. Hey, everybody. We are the Sassy Silver Sisters. I'm Kathy. I'm Rhonda. And Kelly cannot be here today, unfortunately, but she's doing a good thing. She's watching her baby grandbaby. Yay! And, um, so right now we're doing our video day without her, unfortunately. Oh, well. I know. Oh, well. Okay, now, what do these crayons mean to you? Art. Coloring. I used to like to color. I love, oh, and this is, remember when they first came out with the great big giant the box? The big box. With the, um, the sharpener inside. Oh, oh my God. gosh, I couldn't wait that to get it. That was a big deal. Yes, I, I couldn't it. wait to get a, a new box of crayons. Yep. But anyway, this is a story about a little girl named Ella Tryon, T-R-Y-O-N, of Chardon, Ohio. Making a difference with crayons. That's why I asked, hmm. what do crayons mean to you? Okay, coloring, art. Not the first thing I think of when you're making a difference. Right. Hmm. So, in July of 2016, Ella was taken to Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital in Cleveland, Ohio, for serious medical concerns. While at the hospital, Ella wanted to color a rainbow. Hmm. Ella and her mom found that they uh, did not appear to be enough crayons for every child. And the ones they did were like, you know, how they get, they're broken yeah. and worn down. Yeah. Yeah. This was very disappointing to Ella. And as she was unable to leave her room due to her treatment, mm. um, Ella told her mom she wished every child could have their own box of crayons. And that is how... Help Me Color a Rainbow started. Hmm. Ella is home. She's better. And she has to return to rainbows every few months for follow-ups. Hmm. Uh, in October, I know this is an older story, but October 24th, 2016, Ella was able to deliver over 13,000 donated boxes of crowns. To Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital in Cleveland, that's, Ohio. That's a lot. This is of a little girl, people. She continues to do fundraisers, and you can keep track of her on Facebook. Her page is Help Me Color a Rainbow, and thank you, Miss Ella. For inspiring us to help. Great job. Follow her example. And if you can't follow her example, you can always support her. So go to her page. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Miss Ella. Yeah, great idea. Yes. So you guys go ahead. Start collecting crayons. Take them to your hospitals or wherever there's children that have to be there for a while. Yeah. Yeah. It, it does make a, a difference. It's a day in the hospital. <laughs> Can you imagine? I mean, they supply crayons for kids in restaurants because they're antsy. Yeah, yeah. So when I saw this story, I'm going, why don't I think of things like this? But she found a need, and she is doing a great job. Thank you, Miss Ella. Yeah, I know a lot of children thank you, too. So. Oh, yes. The children love to color. So you guys start your own crayon drive. That's a good idea. I love it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, everybody, support our our um, page by liking, thumbs up, and following us. And you can follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Google Plus. Yes, what else have you got us on? Oh my <laughs> gosh, we're everywhere. <laughs> Just Google Sassy Silver Sisters, and you'll find us. And um, make sure you bring, bring your sass. sass.